Hey guys and welcome to my channel. In today's video we are here in Kandalim and I'm going to give you guys a complete Kandalim beach experience. I'm going to take you guys on the streets. I'm going to show you guys the new shacks in this area here. I'm going to show you guys a complete breakfast experience. I'm going to show you guys the sea, the shacks, the prices and everything possible. So let's go and check out this new area here in Kandalim in North Goa. Okay guys, so we are starting off our vlog from here on the streets of Kandalim. I just wanted to show you guys what's happening here right now. As you can see, there's a few restaurants here that are already open. This is early morning and uh, there's quite a lot of international tourists that are here right now. So just to take you down the street and show you guys the way to the beach. As I said, it's a new area that I'm taking you guys to. As you can see, there's more international tourists here and we are going to take the road towards the right here, which is called the Horizon Grill here. So once you see the Horizon Grill, we are going to take the road going down. I'm just waiting for traffic. So unfortunately, there's a lot of traffic here. So let's just wait for everybody to pass and then we'll cross the road just to give you guys the feeling that you're here at, at yourselves here and you know you feel that you're as well on the road so okay finally i got a chance to cross so yeah guys we are on the road going down towards the beach so just to show you guys this is a different area of the beach so if you see here there's a lot of shopping on the left as well as there are like rooms for rent here on the top so just to give you guys an idea this is the serenity uh, serenity by the sea beach here and as you can see there's so much of shopping available here there's people from different different countries uh, that are here the, this is the mermaid restaurant and uh, I'm just going to show you guys a few of the hotels that are here uh, in the morning. So it's around uh, 10 o'clock in the morning right now. So this is the Whispering Palms Beach Resort here on the left. And as we go down, there will be a couple of other places. There is the Sunset Beach Resort here on the right. And there's Gaia Beach Hostel as well. So as you can see, the sky is nice and blue today. Uh, it's not those fluffy clouds that we had in my previous vlogs but yeah uh, usually we do have like nice uh, blue skies here with you know the fluffy clouds but today is just a blue sky so this area is very popular with international tourists uh, so you'll probably see quite a lot of international tourists but just to show you some other places this is Chandra Kant restaurant here uh, there's also La Sea View which is a hotel that is there over there uh, this is Jack Deck and uh, this is the parking area. So what we are going to do is of course there is uh, parking right up ahead. So I'm going to park over there. But there is also a big car parking area available here. So if you come by car as well, that's not a problem at all. You can come and park over here. Uh, and of course bike parking is directly available here. So what I'm going to do is let's park my bike and let's continue so now that i've parked my bike let's get on to the beach just to tell you guys a new property is opening up over here which is called shambhala beach lounge here and it's going to be very beautiful it's like right in front of the beach good morning so let's walk down to the beach this part of the beach is a little bit muddy with a little bit of sand mix so your feet too tend to get a little bit of mud on them but of course, the moment we reach the beach, you know, that's just going to wash off when we get into the water. But good to see there's quite a decent amount of crowd. Guys, all the mess that is here right now is just because shacks were just, just built recently. So it's uh, just done up for the last few days. So just to show you guys, there is the Goan Beach Hut uh, here. I've done a vlog on this place before but if you see they've done it up completely different this time and the beauty of this area is like leading up to the shacks you have all of these uh, nice pathways that are here which you don't get at the other side of the beach which is the main Kandalim beach so here we have the Goan beach hut good morning my friend how are you yeah so this is the owner there and this is the shack this is the Goan beach hut there are other shacks that are here as well Good morning, good morning. I'll come in a while. Yeah, good. So, just to uh, show you guys, I was just saying hi to the 
owners of the shacks there. As you can see, there's a lot of people here and there are shacks on both sides of the beach here. So we'll just walk down here a little bit. Uh, there's also international people fishing, which is surprising. I've, this is the first time I'm seeing that uh, in this area here. So he's fishing here and as you can see, the water is just beautiful right now. So just to give you guys an idea of the shacks that are here, as I mentioned, uh, the, these are all new shacks that are here in this area. Uh, they're very beautiful and, you know, definitely one of the nicer areas to come to because this is very peaceful and quiet. And if you see the water here, let's just walk into the water and give you guys a little bit of idea. Oh, wow. Okay, so it's pretty deep over there. But yeah, so just the sound of the waves here crashing, it just makes your day. Such a beautiful morning here in Goa. So of course, we'll just walk down uh, to the beach and show you guys the scenes from here. So that shack over there is the Goan Beach Hut. And of course, there's a lot of international tourists that are here right now. And, you know, if you want to click photos, you can click some really good photos because these different beach, uh, you know, beach beds have different, different colors. Kaisa hai? Madam, kitna hai beach bed ke liye? Kit, kitna leta hai beach bed ke liye? Oh, beach bed ke liye kitna leta hai? 100 rupees? 200? Kuch pata ne? Okay, so they don't know. <laughs> I was just asking the prices. But yeah, just to show you guys, there are other shacks here and if you see that, that is so nice right there, which is like this nice swing which you can take good photos. Yeah, huh? Acha, acha, okay. Okay. So the beach beds, the lady just went and asked. So the beach beds are free if you're eating or drinking at the shacks. So this area, because it is a fairly, you know, nice area and they don't have too many tourists here. So... That is why the beach beds are free. But of course, if you go to the main Kandalim beach, which is right over there, uh, then that's they, they charge you like 100 or 200 rupees per hour for the beach beds. But I would prefer coming to an area here and, you know, just relaxing and seeing some nice relaxed vibes. So this is Ryan Shack here. So guys, I hope you just feel like you're walking on the beach with me here early morning in Goa. It's around 10.20 now. And here's Ryan's shack. And just to show you, I'll be coming to do a vlog here at Ryan's shack. It's very nice. They also have like these cabanas here. Just to show you these really nice cabanas where you can click some really nice photos. It gives you like those Bali kind of vibes here. Hi, hi. Good morning. So that's the owner there. So I'm just going to take you guys inside and let's say hi to him as well. So this is the shack inside. Good morning, brother. How are you? How are you, man? Good. Good to see you, man. Yeah. So hi. this is the owner. If you ever come here, come and meet him. Good morning. <laughs> good, good morning. Yeah. So I'll just show around a little bit. So this is the area inside here. So as you can see, very nice vibe. Very, you know, pleasant. And just to show you guys, look at this, guys. How beautiful is this? So it gives you a very pleasant, beautiful view of the beach. Okay guys, so I'm just sitting here at the shack and my breakfast has just arrived. So I ordered some beautiful breakfast here. So as you can see, uh, what is this? Prawns mayo sandwich. Sir. Okay, so this is prawns mayo salad? Sandwich. Sir. Sandwich, okay, prawns mayo sandwich. Look at that guys, there's literally like huge prawns in there. And then we have avocado, toast, and eggs. And of course, I have my orange juice here. I'm sitting with this amazing gentleman. We have been having a nice chat. Uh, can you tell uh, the viewers your name? Yeah, it's Steve. Steve. Yeah. yeah. Okay. yeah. So Steve, where are you from? UK, England, yeah. East Coast. Okay. So Steve is from the UK. Of course, we are going to have breakfast. And then, of course, we're going to ch chat with Steve for a little bit. Okay guys, so I'm going to have my breakfast now, but just to show you guys, he brought me something else right now. What is this? Uh, this is green tea, sir. Green tea, wow. Yeah. Look at the way it's served. It looks so good. So this is green tea. What's your name? Uh, my name is Pankaj Singh, sir. Pankaj Singh. So Pankaj yeah. Singh is going to serve us some nice green tea. And of course, I have my breakfast here. So uh, let's see how he pours it now. So, wow. Look at that, guys. 
Can you pour it for me, please? Yeah, of course, wow. So look at that, guys. How amazing is this? So some green tea, a beautiful breakfast morning here in Khandalim, right in front of the beach. And as you can see, guys, the vibe is so amazing here right now. There's quite a lot of people that have just entered into the shack and there's so many people here right now. And of course, we have my breakfast which looks absolutely amazing. Your breakfast, sir. Thank you so much. Yeah, so, okay, let's uh, start eating the best part of the day. So just to show you guys, we have like this whole spread of different things that are here. I have my tea, which is the green tea, uh, which looks amazing. So this is the green tea here. Uh, just to show you guys, so I'm all alone doing all my setup here. So just cheers, guys. Wow fresh orange juice nice and cold right on the beach so the prawn sandwich I have never had one of these on the beach before but I'm just showing you guys look at that guys look at the prawns in there that's huge prawns it looks absolutely incredible so let's take a nice big bite of this <laughs> mm. Wow, just amazing. So, the prawns are so soft and succulent. And that salad with the prawns just goes so well. If you ever come to Goa and want to try something for breakfast, guys, this is something you should really try. I just asked the owner, give me something which is unique and you know I want to try something different today and he brought me this amazing deliciousness beautiful so over here we're having the avocado toast so what I'll do is I'm just going to put the avocado on the toast here with the eggs so the gentleman from England we've been having a nice chat and you know it's just He's been a viewer of mine as well and such a lovely person and you know I love this about Goa every time you come here you know you just uh, meet somebody on the beach and you can have a lovely conversation like even if you come here solo I'm sure you'll have a great time Ryan Shack is just amazing the, I showed you guys the view but yeah I'm going to show you guys like the vibe a little bit more in just a little bit and yeah so I'm cutting my eggs here Sorry guys, I'm making an absolute mess, but look at that, look at that, how beautiful does that look? So eggs, toast, mm. I'll mention the prices down here below, so you guys have an idea of how much everything is. And of course, I'm just going to show you guys the menu in just a little bit, but yeah, let's try the tea now. So cheers with the tea. Y'all are so used to seeing me with beers before, but today is uh, ni nice, nice. So I'm just having a tea. Come, come sit here with me. So we have the owner here with me. So the owner is a friend of mine. If you ever come to the shack, you can come and meet him. He's a very chilled yes, out sure. guy. Thank you. And you know, this sandwich is really good. What is it called again? This is called the Prawns Mayo Sandwich. Prawns Mayo Sandwich. What are the other things that are interesting that you have like this? Uh, we have chicken uh, salad sandwich like that. Okay. And we have a uh, tuna melt which is uh, goes similar. Okay. And uh, we give the fresh lettuce you can see. Yeah, yeah. With that, and we use a very, very less si. high quality mayonnaise in this. Okay, okay. Yes. So yeah, if you ever come, come and meet the owner. And of course, now let me just take you guys around and show you a little bit more of the shack. Okay, guys. So I'm sitting at this place here in the shack just to show you guys the shack around a little bit more now that there's more crowd here so if you see here there's people from all over the world that are here and i've met so many incredible people so just to take you uh, guys back to the beach and show you guys a little bit about the beach here and if you can see so many uh, people at the shacks here but this shack is absolutely incredible there are more people here and the, they have like some really nice washrooms and you know it's super clean and everything so this is not a sponsored video guys i just happened 
to come here and I wanted to show you guys, you know, the experience. This is one of the most beautiful looking sharks here. And what we'll do is, uh, let me just show you guys the menu. So you guys have an idea of the prices here. So if you're planning to come, you know, you just have an idea of what the prices are like. So these are like the prices. You just pause the video. And, you know, if you are looking for like a really beautiful vibe and you just want to have a relaxed atmosphere, then this is one of the best places to come to. As you can see here, like people having a really nice time, having their beers. And, you know, I just wanted to give you guys like a full shack experience and have an idea of what the shacks are like. So you have like salads, they have like the salads, sandwiches. The breakfast uh, menu here so here are the prices of the you know the one which i got is the prawns mayo that's 300 rupees and here you see they have like different uh, other fruit bowls and things like that so if you're coming to the beach you have an idea of how much to pay so like if you see butter chicken is 350 and they have good size portions as well so these are the prices just pause the price and see and they also have like lobsters crabs and everything i'm probably going to come and do another video here very soon and show you guys so if you see the prices here so of course they have menu has just got done the shack literally opened a couple of days ago so anyway i'm having an absolutely time of my life here i mean i still cannot finish this it is so big and it is so nice but yeah, so what we'll do is let's go further down in just a little bit and show you guys a little bit more of the beach. Okay guys, so now that we had breakfast here, I'm just going to take a little walk down the beach and show you guys what the crowds are like right now. So this is the Ryan Shack that we were at. And as you can see, there's quite a lot of people here. And you know, the, that is the gentleman who's our viewer. I was having a lovely chat with him. We had an amazing time and there are many other viewers of mine that I saw down at the beach so we are just going to take a little walk here and i want to show you guys a little bit more of the scenes so now it is around 12 o'clock in the afternoon so i spent a lot of time at the you know ryan shack i was just having breakfast and you know i like to talk a lot to people so i made a lot of friends there from england and different places and we were just having a long conversation and and two hours later we have you know the beach now so let me just show you guys this area of the beach and there are different other shacks that are available here as well so the moment you enter in this is another entrance to the beach here which, which is called the rams shack so that is an entrance that you can come from you can go to ryan shack from rams as well as the place which we came also if you want to but i like ryan's because of you know the ambience is very nice and they like you know in a couple of days they will have pool tables and they'll have absolutely everything possible available so you see here this area is very popular for international tourists compared to the main kandalim beach which is right over there so in the main kandalim beach there's probably like uh, 10 15 thousand people right now because you, I don't know if you can see it, I'm just trying to zoom in and let me just show you guys. But there in the distance it is completely packed. Okay, so let's just walk up a little bit closer here to the shacks. That's Ram Shack there. And just to show you guys a couple of the shacks here. There is a shack which is further down there which is called Bob Mali. I like this area of the beach because it is really nice and quiet and you know you can swim in peace here if you go to the main kandalim beach uh, then there's a lot of crowd and what happens is the lifeguards keep on telling you uh, come this side or come that side because of the water sports so here you have like a very peaceful relaxed vibe the you know you can swim see the people are swimming out there so far away and you can just have an such a relaxed you know time here so we have the Bob Mali Beach Shack here and this one seems to be quite a popular shack as you see you have so many international tourists that are here at this point of time. So this is the Bob Mali Shack which is here at the uh, other entrance of the beach which I was saying. So that is like the Ram Shack Beach entrance. So <laughs> that umbrella went flying. 
there are other nice places that are opening up here so if you see that place there let me just zoom in and let me just show you so if you see this place is opening up uh, very soon and this is also a very beautiful place and there's so many international tourists at those shacks as well but what i'm going to do is i'm going to go back and show you guys from the entrance where we entered okay guys so we made it back to the entrance of the shacks here which we came from so just to show you guys the update if you see here there's so many people that have come into the beach right now and it's just a lovely day of course it is quite humid right now and there's so many people on the shacks so there's people from all over and that's the entrance that we came in from but i just wanted to show you guys like the crowd situation right now so if you see there's quite a lot of people that are here right now and yeah so this is the beautiful kandalim beach area guys and i hope you enjoyed this video so if you want to see more videos like this please do like and subscribe and i'll be bringing you guys lots of other videos from here in goa